Hey YouTube, we're going to be doing the top five tweaks of the week. Today's March 19th. First one you're looking at on the springboard here is called Vexel. V-E-X-I-L. It's available for $1 in Cydia. And what it does is it allows you to change a multitude of different things on your springboard. This thing is off the hook if you want to change up the way your lock screen looks this is definitely the way to go uh, you can change anything on the top bar you can add animations to your uh, sliders and the, as they come in the banners you can put it on any of those different animations uh, you can change the color you can see now we got it on a pink let's change it to a gold so you see what that looks like you can change the position of the time uh, Actually, I don't think I have the time turned on right now, but if it were on, it would be center, top, let's say left. Um, you can change font, you can change the size by scrolling it to the right, and time text, you can change it instead of the time, you can put it whatever you want it to say, like I had a Hello YouTube in there. Um, you can change the position of the date. All that can be changed right on the fly without any type of uh, respring or anything like that. And you can see you can also change something down here in the slider. That's Vexel. Next one is Instant Camera. This is by far one of the best tweaks I think that's been released in a while. Especially if you are a photographer with your iPhone and you enjoy taking a lot of pictures or video. You can actually set up an activator with this to open your camera however you see fit I simply have mine set to triple press the home button and you see the camera pops right open and you can actually just flip the, the uh, video on that way if you wish um, but it gives you all of your options everything just like you're in your camera app then when you sit push the home button again you go back to the original screen you were on when you opened it up. Uh, up next, multi-dock. You see this two rows down here. Uh, instant camera, by the way, was $1. Multi-dock is $1.99. That's the two rows of icons you see down at the bottom that's not moving. Uh, and you can set that to be as many of the rows as you want, up to five. You see, you see I could have from anywhere from none all the way to five and you can change the number of icons per row I have mine set to four I think it looks better five looks pretty good and it goes all the way to 15 however if you had 15 row icons in a row there's no way you could even touch one of them probably they wouldn't even activate that's multi-dock it's an awesome awesome tweak one of my all-time favorite tweaks that we just released this week is called tap to widgets and this allows you to actually let's auto close we don't want to do that it puts a number of things in your notification you see here I have notes reminder and calendar events and Twitter and Facebook's not in there because I have it sitting down here and if I wanted to remove Twitter, all I would have to do is just pull it down there. And now you see I just have the three um, notes. I had the notes, reminders, and calendar up here at the top. And you can put them in any kind of order that you want. You just simply drag them and drop them anywhere with your finger right here. And if you wanted to turn that separator off, that little line between each one of them, you can even turn it off. However, I think it looks a little better with it. So I'm going to leave it on. And this is called Tap to Widgets. And if you have like uh, Lock Info or um, Dashboard X installed, you can actually install these uh, widgets on your home screen or on your uh, or any other place where you can tap and hold. You know what I'm talking about. You can install it like that too. Today we're going to be looking at a new tweak by Jay Freeman the guy that created Cydia called Sci U. I think that's the correct way to pronounce it but anyway that's what we'll call it uh, anyway what this does guys is just simply adds a new way 
for adding a playlist inside your music. We're going to set up a, a new playlist. All right, we can all, we can go directly into PsyQ if we want to, and simply hit edit and add up here to the top to add more songs from our playlist that we have already created the purchase one is the one we're looking at here on me uh, it'll actually pull up the songs that you have on your device and even if you want to reorder these you can do it from here but you can also clear and delete any of these that you want uh, but if you want to go back into your songs here you can actually just tap the, the song and it'll pop up play now play next or play last and you can select whichever one you want to do that say we want to say play next and we'll play bullets last okay so if we go back in here to our playlist and to say you and you see bullets is last and are you ready was the actual second song that I put in here and that's pretty much all it does guys it just adds a new way and an added way to create a new playlist and a cue list for songs that's playing you can set songs up to play after that song finishes and so on so forth on down the line so if you think you can use this it's 249 in the uh, I think it's the Big Boss repo uh, you can grab it over there and that's all. If you think you like these type videos, please hit that subscribe button before you leave. It really helps the channel and keep coming back.